guys. I do believe we have a comedy video. John Panette, is that how you pronounce it? Um, Dom, let me know how you guys feel about him. Let me know if he guys will make you laugh. Try not to laugh challenge and we'll see how it goes. Never ever react to him, never heard of him. Pew, I know. So shout out to our subscriber that introduced me to this comedian. Let's see how he comes in. My friends took me camping to see what would happen to me. It's a lot of fun. I'm not a camper. If you like to camp, that's great. I don't understand it. I guess campers that love it, they think, oh, it's like the settlers, the explorers, the pioneers. I don't think so. I think they did what they had to do. They built a foundation for us to live on, not in tents. If Lewis and Clark saw a Hilton, they wouldn't have camped. So I don't appreciate camping. Camping to me is when room service closes at 11. If it's 11.30, I go, I'm camping. And I huddle by the TV and wait for pizza to come. He extra. <laughs> Unnecessary. Like that Survivor show? I don't do well in the outdoors. They said, Survivor, you could win a million dollars. Not enough money. If I wake up in the morning and I have to look in the woods <laughs> for breakfast, nobody has to vote me off the island. I'm putting out my own torch. <laughs> One less for the kitchen tribe. Hey, I'm kidnapping the host until you get me out of here. <laughs> At least a couple days. So a few years ago, we went camping. I flew into Boston from Las Vegas. They had a Winnebago. It was beautiful. I said, okay, camping. We drove up to Maine, which is nice, but it's also the setting of most of Stephen King's novels. And we go about nine hours Scary. on the Maine Turnpike. And at, you can't go nine hours. We're in Russia. And we're asking directions, and people are saying creepy Maine stuff like, Going way up there, huh? Yeah, why? 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 So we get to the end of Maine near Russia, and it is beautiful. It's air like you've never breathed before. A pristine lake. If there was a hotel, it would have been nice. Now it's, I thought we were camping in the Winnebago. Wouldn't you think that? No, we're leaving the Winnebago. And we're going to hike two miles. <laughs> and we're going to camp in tents next to the lake. I don't want to leave the Winnebago. In the horror movies, they leave the Winnebago, and the happy chubby one always dies second or third. <laughs> he said something like, who wants a marshmallow? <laughs> Either that, or they portray big people as stupid. They say something like, I heard a scream, I'm gonna go look. <laughs> they didn't tell me to bring any camping stuff. I had my luggage from the airport, and my panda suit on. <laughs> And I'm dragging him through the woods. A bear saw me and went, Hi. <laughs> My mood turned. I felt like Gollum on his way to Mordor. You don't have any friends. They left you in the woods to die. They took away our Winnebago. That was my precious. Now... <laughs> <laughs> now, we have tents to put up, and I would like to do some construction after a flight, <laughs> in a drive to Russia, in a hike. Let's do some construction now. I was too tired. They gave me a little tent. I wrapped myself in it. It was just a little one. What? I woke up at 3 o'clock in the morning. I was starving, and they hide the food from the bears. Did you know this? Because bears can't climb trees? Yeah, well, neither can I. So that tree had to come down. I don't even know how I chopped it down. I might have bit it down in a blind fury. <laughs> Next day, the park ranger's yelling at me about the tree. Listen, I'm sorry, I was starving. I see about a million trees around here. Here's my credit card. Buy a tree. Buy a tree. Then they told me we didn't bring a lot of food. There's a lake, we're gonna catch most of our food. There better be cows in that water. <laughs> he said he's not eating fish. <laughs> if there are cows in the water, I'll catch them myself. <laughs> Start the grill, I'm going down again. <laughs> Uh, so he was low-key funny, you guys. He had a few jokes here and there. 
Um, you guys let me know how you guys feel about John. He definitely made me laugh though. Um, he doesn't like camping. He loves to eat. So that's two facts we know about him. He is not about to put up with the shit. Me personally, I like camping. I put camping like two times and I like camping, you guys. I um, like the adventureness. I like to, you know, explore and explore the world and well, I don't explore the world, but I would love to. <laughs> You guys let me know down in the comments. For a million dollars, you guys, I will definitely, definitely start myself for a few days. Definitely. I don't care. <laughs> let me know how you guys feel down in the comments. Smash the like button, hit that red you guys. Let me know how you guys feel about John. Let me know if you guys laugh down in the comments. Did you lose like me? Probably. And let's go.